Welcome, mates. I am Bloodthirsty Lord, but you Lordy, and tell we're back on Fortnite Battle Royale. And the update just went live with a Valentine crossbow, followed by the events that will sooner come very soon, obviously. But today, we're going to try and get the weapon and see how strong this is. Is it overpowered? And see the benefits of using this crossbow weapon. The Cupid crossbow. What do you want to call it? I can't wait to get it. Is that right there? Wait, is that that purple thing down there? If it is, I'm going for it. Boys, why do I feel like that is? Oh, no, it's auto semi sniper. Never mind. Nobody wants that. Oh, full damage. Shit. Too much full damage. Okay, let's get this. But also, mates, golden scale. What the hell? Luck on point. This is my first game on the new patch. So make sure to smash that blade like button. We are aiming for 200 likes on this video. That'd be greatly appreciated if we do achieve that goal. And the goal is to find this new weapon. I really want my bloody crossbow. I want to get it as soon as possible. I don't want this to take forever. The minigun we got very quickly. I'm hoping the same thing happens here. And we get this super quick. This is looking like a pretty good loadout. Like nothing bad about it at all. I wonder if someone's in here. No one's in here. Wait, someone's in here. I know someone's in here. Oh, he's playing sneaky. He's sneaking around. This little bugger is sneaking around. He thinks he can do that against me. That is such a bad choice, mate. He's so hurt. There we go. Easy. Okay, I thought I was going to die for a second. Lucky we didn't. Oh, he has the crossbow! Hey, boys! This is lit. Let's activate this. Hopefully no one else is here. We might drop the legendary minigun to pick up the crossbow instead. Not too bad. Okay, that looks sick. Wait, wait. The icon looks amazing down the bottom. Does it shoot one bolt per second? It actually shoots five bolts. And it's got a scope. What? What's the range on this? There's some type of fall on it as well. This is interesting. This guy right next to the truck. He doesn't know I see him. Oh! Boys, drop the floss. Woo! <laughs> One shot, headshot. 150 damage. What is this weapon? Oh my god. Is this overpowered? Is this declared overpowered? I don't know. I don't know, but it does some insane damage. Plus, unlimited ammo is really nice benefit. One shot headshot's really good. This weapon actually excels, I think, close to medium. Because I think the further away it goes, it's pretty bad. Maybe like around 50 meters is good. Yeah, 50 meters to like 60, it's all right. I think anything past that, it'd be tragic to use. Do we even pick up the other guy's items? I was so into the weapon, I didn't even check the other guy's loot. Did you hear that? He knows something's weird. He knows something's weird. He saw me. He saw me. I'm detected. How do you land this shit? It's so hard. What? Okay, I love the way it looks though. It's amazing. Is he camping in a bush? The reload time is kind of bad. But we're not going to focus on that. I can't land this, can I? Ooh, he hurts me, man. Sorry. Huh? I played that so bad. Okay, that was my first game. Don't judge. Please don't judge. That was a mint headshot before. I couldn't land a shot on that guy though. I'm really overwhelmed by the weapon. It seems really fun. I'm going to try to jump into the second game and see how good it actually is. And hopefully get it again and just have a fun time. Okay, we're back for a second time. Hopefully this does work. There's two variants to this weapon. There's an epic version and a rare version. We just got the epic version in the first part. I'm hoping to get it again and try and go beast-like with it. And get close to winning or just have some crazy moments with the actual weapon. Can we do anything? See that, man. Oh, he has a crossbow already. Oh, my God. We have a decent setup. We're going to try and land as many shots as we can with a the crossbow. Then switch to the other weapons if we need to do so. Another crossbow. Nah, not yet. We're going to just use one crossbow. I don't want to risk it yet. Maybe for a future video, we'll do like... A double crossbow thing. Nah, I think that'd be interesting to see. Was it just me and another guy that landed here and no one else? Is that honestly what just happened? I want to see how good this is for no scoping too. It could actually be really dirty for no scoping. There's only 32 people alive. What? I've only got one kill. That is so surprising. There's a possibility we can actually win this. Like, I need more material. I need at least 500 wood. Something decent to work with. In case we go into a full team fight. Or full fight in this case because we're playing solo. And I'm hoping this weapon's super accurate. I need to get good with this weapon and make sure I land my shots. The exact same way I landed my sniper shots. So I feel like this weapon has a lot of full early compared to the sniper does. I need some gunshots in the actual 
Um, industrial part here. A blue lake. I see him. Oh! We land on the shop, I didn't do any damage towards his body. Sorry, man, I had to do it. I had to do it. I didn't want to risk it at all. We landed a body shop. I only tickled him. Oh, we have to run. Oh, no. Let's see where the next circle is. Please be close by. Okay, that's not that bad. That's actually not that bad. We'll go from this side and get to the circle. I need to make sure I'm completely aware. Because this crossbow can pack a punch. You just need to land a headshot. Honestly, I feel like the headshots, 150 damage, pretty dirty. I'm hoping the crossbow becomes an actual weapon in the future. Because unlimited ammo on a weapon is such a good idea. And especially like a weapon like this, it feels good using it. But there's obviously weaknesses to using it. Because the fire rate's obviously super slow. But the one shot, if you get a headshot, it's kind of deadly. There's a staircase down there. Someone's been here. Is he still here, though? Grenade. Oh, there's actual range to it. It's capped at a range, I think. I saw the color go away. Both these guys are fighting. One of them just won with a shotgun. Hopefully, I can clean up that person when he's picking up items. Hey! Oh, there's a kiss effect! What the hell? I killed him and he, then a kiss noise. Whoa. He had no clue that bullet was coming. Or that arrow in this case. That's crazy good. Let's pick up all this juicy loot. This guy had a crossbow too, but it's only a blue version. Not a bad weapon. Honestly, not a bad weapon. Has potential for late game. Just once you get noticed, it's kind of trash-like. Because in a 1v1 situation, you don't want a crossbow. I think, honestly, crossbow is the worst thing to have out in a 1v1 situation. Unless you end up being a crossbow god. Which is going to take a while to get used to. There's 13 people alive and I don't see anyone. I might hold the back section of this. Or we go towards one of the hills and hold it. Problem is by holding a hill, you leave yourself vulnerable to um, being collapsed on. And now I don't get sniped because I'm in an open field. So many possibilities and so many things could occur. Hopefully we can win this. I feel in my bones, there's 9 people alive. I think we can do it. We have some metal, we can use that to build the actual base. I don't know if we can do it though. Like survive through this whole thing with a crossbow, but hey. Get a couple more kills with the crossbow, I'm pretty happy. And get our first win with it on the first hour of release. Oh, that was close. I knew someone else was going to be there on the other hill. Okay. Where's this little bugger hiding? Is he still in the circle? I think he's still in the circle. Okay, there's two guys. I'm honestly hoping that I don't get collapsed on. Because getting collapsed by four people at the same time is actually going to be hell to deal with. I do have a minigun, so I can use that to my advantage and blow down people's bases. Like, so... So that's 100% fun. And then close that. Back to normal. Still got fire and bullets, so I can just wreak havoc whenever I can. I actually love this build. It's so good. I just need now test the distance on this crossbow. He's got the crossbow too. Okay, let me check. Where is he? This guy's built even higher. Oh my god. Because he got circle. So lucky. Try and build up. Try and build up. Oh no, we have material. Let's destroy this guy's base. Someone's flanking from behind. Did they both survive? Someone survived there. Where's the guy in the woods? I don't see the guy in the woods. I'm trying to apply as much pressure as I can while trying to verse these guys. Someone's versing right now. Should we contest this? I'm out of materials, no! There's some there. Okay, we got some now. I can't land this shot, man. 
It's so hard. Are they both in there? Can we kill him with just the minigun? Oh my god, I'm just, I stuffed that up. So close, man, so close. I want to use the crossbow, but I know it's risky. Hey, there we go. Easy. That pressure. Amazing. Okay. My final thoughts on this crossbow. It's really good. I need practice with my aiming with it, though. I feel really rusty with the aiming with that sight. And it felt a little bit weird, but I feel like if I get used to it, it should be quite easy to get headshots from a good close to medium range and even further distance. Because it does like 50 to 70 damage body shot, but then when it does a headshot, it's like 150 damage. So it's pretty good. I think it's a very useful item to use, or weapon, especially if you're going stealth-like. So I think it's really good. That's my general opinion. It's not really overpowered. Feels a bit legendary when you use it. And it does have a limited ammo, which is a really nice benefit. But mates, as always, tell me your opinions and thoughts in the comment section down below. What do you think about the crossbow, the Valentine crossbow, aka Cupid's crossbow? Tell me your opinions and thoughts in the comment section down below. And also, if you did enjoy this video, show us by smash that button like button. We are aiming for 200 likes in this video. That we greatly appreciate if you do achieve that goal. And also, if you make want to see more Fortnite gaming content and gaming content in general on my channel, all you do is show us your friends and hit the subscribe button to be our mate today. And that is all for this video. Over time to over, don't you worry. Back very soon. Hey, Dad's boys, you ain't seen nothing yet. Mates, one day, I'll become the crossbow god, and then they take the weapon out of the game, you never see it again. Yeah, kinda sad. <laughs>